In cases where you can't see your Rubik's Connected Cube in the Rubik's Connected Apps pairing screen, we advise to check the following. Make sure your Rubik's Connected Cube is charged. To do that, please take the Rubik's charging cable. Make sure it's connected to USB power source on one end and connect the other end to the yellow center cap on your Rubik's Cube. If the cube is charging, you should see a charging indication light shine beneath the Rubik's logo. Please note that if your cube's battery is flat, it might take up to 20 minutes for the light to shine. Make sure that Bluetooth connectivity is turned on. If it is, please turn it off and back on again. Make sure that location services are turned on on Android devices, or the Bluetooth connectivity is allowed on iOS devices. When first launching the app on an Android device, you will be asked to enable location services. In case you clicked on disable, you can grant the necessary permissions from within your device's settings. On iOS devices, you will be asked to enable Bluetooth for new connections. If you haven't enabled it upon first use, please go to your device's settings and enable it from there. Please make sure that your device is compatible with our requirements, which are iOS 6 or higher, Android OS 6.0 or higher, Bluetooth version 4.1 or above. If all of the previous advice didn't help, please consider restarting your device and try connecting your cube again. In case your cube still can't be seen by the Rubik's app, please consider restarting your Rubik's connected cube. We have a separate video that covers how to do it.